Hi everybody, so you need to know how to delete synced media from your phone after deleting them from the ad set and it doesn't work for you. Well, first of all, let's talk about the synced media. If you go into the headset, you can easily delete using the storage option, delete files. But if you go to the app library and to the files, you have the option to sync your files. So for those of you who are not aware, press app library, then go and search for the files app and there will have the option to sync the files. What sync synchronization does is upload it to Oculus Cloud and then share it to your phone app. So you're gonna see this icon. You can share, by the way, entirely sync all the files by pressing this icon and do it, do it for each file individually. So once it's done in the background, it's gonna upload the, your files, your media videos and images to the cloud and then gonna download them again to your phone, all right? Then if you go uh, to all or synced one uh, and you look, you can see that you can see the image or the video, but there's no way to delete anything. Now, if you go to the menu and then devices, you can see the sync media there. Then you can actually tap and interact with it and view it. Now I can show you again, this is on November 20th, 2022. Uh, if I'm gonna go to the files app uh, and I'm gonna sync, you're gonna see, I'm gonna get the message. If you do it for the first time, uh, it's gonna display a message. All right, so we can see that it says uh, that uh, media will be unsync and automatically removed from the Oculus app after 40 days, 14 days. So again, there's no way to actually do it manually unless you want to go into the uh, headset app. But as you can see here, this is from Oculus uh, support answer for one of the users. This is from last year, but the same goes, by the way, to this year, it's the same. You have to wait 14 days for your data to be deleted. Now I do hope there will be an update. This is a must, by the way. It's not even a question whether it should be uh, giving users the option to delete uh, apps. Maybe it will be like, it is like that because you know it just saves uh, uh, money for the company because uh, either using some kind of a CDN uh, that, you know, the cost for actually maintaining and deleting uh, files after a longer period of time costs less to store. I mean, it's something similar to that when I, you know, with Amazon Web Services, so maybe that's the reason it just costs less compared to if you want to delete files immediately. But again, I'm not sure. So that's it. If you have any other tips and tricks, let us know in the comment section below. If you have any other way to solve it, I'll see you on the next one.